Hey, Conroy. How are you? I'm good, I'm good. We gotta do this. All right. What is it we gotta do? Get a load of this. One of Dog Eyes' crew's trying to sell fucking catamaran on our turf. I figured it'll be perfect if the cop showed up. Save us the trouble of killing him. You know what I mean. Jesus, Ricky, what's happening? It's the 18K. They're all over the damn place. They're trying to kill Uncle Poe. <sighs> Shit. Where the fuck is Uncle Paul? I don't know! Where the fuck is Uncle Paul? He's over there!
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, easy, easy. 18K shut off the power. Uncle Poe is on life support. If we don't get backup power running right away, he won't make it. Okay, look, there's a control station down the hall. I'm on it. These guys are beginning to annoy me. Can we lock this place up? I'll take care of it. I got you covered. All right, all right. I'm coming back. Wait, give me a hand. I think we're clear. That was close. Nice work. No, man. We just got lucky. Where was our backup? I mean, who was looking out for us? <sighs> Fuck. No one ever looks out for you in this town. I don't know, man. Feels like the game has changed. Used to be a brotherhood. There was a code. Even amongst rival triads. Now we're killing each other at weddings. Even in a fucking hospital. And for what? Let's get out of here. More cops. Kiddo, kiddo! We go! What the fuck are you doing? There's a lot of them. I'm beginning to dislike them.
Glad you showed up, Way. I appreciate you calling me. So what's next? It's up to Uncle Poe. But I'm guessing war. Yeah, against who? Those guys were 18K. I'm starting to wonder. A lot of people stand to benefit if Uncle Poe never leaves the hospital. He might walk out of there alive. I hope so. When the dog eyes is gone, this shit keeps happening. It might be that someone is pulling strings, trying for a move that lands him in control of the triad. The 18K are getting out of hand. We have to send them. Look, I'll drop you here. Cops might be watching the place. Hey, Ricky, keep it tight. And there aren't that many decent guys left in this gang. All right, all right, see you, bye. Well, well, well. Look who decided to join us. Yeah, it's good to see you. Come on in. <laughs> you sure you don't want to fuck her a little before you start? It's no problem at all. I'll just have a swing by your hotel on the way to the studio. <laughs> nah, man, I'm good. But we could do a photo shoot or whatever, and look, I'm sure it'd be fun and all, but that's not why I'm here, dude. Ah, you don't know what you're missing. This baby will fuck you in a way your wife never could. Sonny, this is Way. Way? The infamous Sonny Woe. <laughs> That's me. Infamous and notorious. Glad you could come by. Ricky's told me all about you. This is King. What's good? He's producing Vivian Liu's next big hit. Yeah, it's gonna be hot, man. Way here's the real deal. A bona fide tribe killer from the streets. Cleavers, guns, castrations, whatever you want. Okay. <laughs> Way. Why don't you take King out on the town and show him around? Yeah, anytime. It's like one big playground, man. Nothing's off limits. You want to pick up some girls, get nasty, done. And with Wei, no one will bother you. Nobody fucks with Sun on Yi. Yeah, well, I mean, actually, that sounds all right. If you don't mind showing me around. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I wish I could go with you players, but business calls. All right, cool, man. Yo, it was real nice to meet you, Sonny. Let's hit the streets. Let's do it. Ricky. Listen to this. I've been thinking. We need to get her a movie role of some sort.
I think we'll start at the K-Bar. The VIP room should give us what we need. Hey, it's your town, man. Look at this stuff. How can you say no? So you producing for Sonny? <laughs> Just this one time. And that guy's a piece of work. He's a fucking clown, you ask me. <laughs> I'm glad you said it first. Buddy does good business. Makes everyone a lot of money. But as far as his personality goes... <laughs> good to know we're on the same page. Fact is, you know, I got some other business to discuss. But I don't think my partners back in the States will want to be in bed with that guy. What kind of business? I got friends. Guys I grew up with. They got a real good import and retail thing going. They could use a good Hong Kong app. Access to that good Asian product. You feel me? It's the reason I took the producer here was I heard Vivian and her label had connections. Who they are? To me. Uh, <laughs> well then. I guess this is gonna be like one of them old school business meetings. You know, where you show me around town and try to figure out if we're a good fit. <laughs> Here we are, man. K Bar. Like the VIP karaoke room? It's right this way. Yo, I don't tell me you and me are gonna sing to each other. I mean, I'm here for the low key flavor, but not that low. Let me find us the right kind of art. <laughs> Hey there, what's your name? Katushka. I'm Wei. Well, listen, I saw you looking at my friend and I figured you realized he's a famous American celebrity. And I, I just wanted to ask if you might keep it a secret. <laughs> well, how can I say no? If you're not doing anything, maybe I can buy you silence with a drink. Wanna join us? That's very nice of you. So you're from Russia? Yes. <laughs> How'd you guess? I call it a hunch. Oh, you. <laughs> Here, have a seat. I'm gonna find a few more people to join us. Hello, ladies. Hey, Mr. VIP. Want to buy us girls a drink? <laughs> I don't know. My friend and I are going to enjoy your company? Try us on and see what you get. All right. Why don't you join my friend and me? I'll be in in a second. How about you and I go fuck? You okay, miss? Wait, what guy? Get at my girl. Why did you fuck her? I'm son on you, motherfucker. Now get out of here before I break every bone in your body. Oh, uh, man, no. Sorry. I didn't know who you were. You guys seem like you was getting a little pushy. Well, we get that a lot. Work here? Yes. So, you allowed to join the customers for a drink? Oh, that sounds nice. By the way, I'm Wei. I don't think I've seen you here before. I'm Yeliana. Yeah, yeah. I usually don't come to places like this. I'm here for my friend. Well, if you ever want to hang out at places not like this, let me know. I'd like that. Can I call you? Sounds good. Thanks. Give me a call sometime. Hey. <laughs> Damn, way! <laughs> Who knew Hong Kong was full of such beautiful women? <laughs> Friendly, too. How do you not know Hong Kong had beautiful girls? You just had to come to the right place. Well, I expect you girls to make sure King never makes that mistake again. <laughs> you can count on us, baby. We love American men. <laughs> don't we, Tina? All right, Wei. <laughs> Why don't you show us what you got? Come on, Wei. Let's see those lungs. <laughs> well, I'll show you mine if you show me yours. 
现在我只会黑钱，做大哥养小弟，我要的地盘我都要，想过来。Promising me a See you fitting right in in the state seat. Hello. Yeah. If you ever want to change your seat, I'll keep that in mind. There you are. I've been waiting for you, a safe fly. Stand back. Stand back. Are you crazy? It's icing on the fucking cake. <laughs> In a week or so, all right. I'll tell my boys I got the man for them. All right. They'll want to start slow, but I'm guessing they can move as much product as you can ship. You know, this could be huge, man. These boys got some big ideas too. I'm talking all the legit shit their money goes into. Gotta go somewhere. You feel me? And the feds back home are really cracking down. Brothers might be looking for a little offshore stash. Yeah. And the man who set that up and kept it safe. Yeah, he'd have a whole river of green to deal with. You feel me? Well, I could swing that for you. I still got.